this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. And another video inside of Stampy's uh, lovely world. And look, look, the snowmen have almost completely gone. Well, the actual snowmen have completely gone. There's just a few hats, a candy cane, and a carrot, <laughs> and a, a few parts of their faces are, are left. Oh, look at that little hat down there. Uh, yep. I guess this officially means that Christmas is long in the past, so we're going to have to go and uh, clean all of these up at some point, but not today, because we have a, uh, a very special thing that we're doing today, and come, I need to put this egg down, I keep picking up this egg, and oh, hello, hello Lee Bear, are you you're just doing cleaning the windows, are you, giving them a, a bit of a shine, are you, uh, why don't you go and, uh, what could you clean them with, you could clean them with cake, and tell you what, i got a new way of cleaning windows, if you smear icing all over the, the windows, then I can follow behind you, and I can lick off all of the icing, and then and that way we'll clean the window. So you've got to start here and go the whole way along to the other side, smudging icing all over it. And then if I go... There we go. Oh no, I accidentally got a little bit of the, the horrible cake at the end. Oh, that cake is absolutely disgusting. I don't know why we leave it there. <laughs> it's gone moldy years ago. Anyway, uh, let's eat the tasty new cake, shall we? Nom, 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 nom. There we go. That got rid of the taste of the horrible cake. <laughs> anyway, let's not spend the entire day in my room eating cake. Actually, that does sound pretty fun. No, no, we have things that we need to do. And uh, before we do them, I'm going to go and uh, head to my love garden and announce who it is uh, that I'm going to be adding to it today. Day. And that person is uh, Nicole Andres, and that is because uh, they sent me all of these pictures. And I like them because they're really bright and colourful, and they just got lots of energy. They're happy and have lots of energy, and I really liked all of them. As uh, so I wanted to say thank you very much, Nicole, uh, for sending me all of the pictures, and welcome to my love garden. Right then, Lee Bear, today is the day that we are going to be introducing Harriet to her hill, well, to her house on her hill and her hat shop. <laughs> and so the, the main challenge of the day is going to be trying to get Harriet uh, from wherever she is right now uh, all the way uh, up to, to there. Uh, but before we do that, uh, I thought we should uh, extend a little path leading up there and uh, basically just uh, decorate the area a little bit and just make sure it's all absolutely ready uh, for her arrival. And of course, I'm going to be doing that while being joined by one of my dogs. And you're always quicker than me, Lee Bear, aren't you? <laughs> right, who shall I have join me today? Sherbet, would you like to join me today? If you would like to join me today, please stare forward. Right, Sherbert wants to join me today, and he doesn't sound happy. Lots of my dogs don't sound happy, but there we go. Let's give him some pork chops. There we go. His tail is once again wagging. And uh, now let's go and uh, try and uh, finish off this path then, shall we? Uh, yeah, we just want a, a nicer way to, to get up to it, uh, because at the moment you've got to be quite good at rock climbing to, to get up to her house. And uh, I don't know how good at rock climbing Harriet is. Uh, last time she just climbed on top of a, um, a small shop and got stuck, so I don't know <laughs> how well she's going to do getting up here. Uh, so yeah, what am I doing jumping up here? I guess... Um, Right, that's where we want to end up. I think we could just extend these stairs here. So it goes to here, and then there's a corner, and then it just leads all the way up there. I think that's going to be the, the best way to do it. Uh, so let me go and make a, a crafting table and put it down right here. And uh, let's go and uh, make all of these uh, wooden blocks into planks. And uh, let's go and make some some steps. We're going to keep them oak, uh, just so that way it matches in with the, the stairs that are already leading up. And I don't want them this wide, though. I think that's a little bit too wide. I think it'll look a little bit odd here. So let's go and do it. Uh, what should we do? Should we do three blocks wide? Uh, might be uh, quite nice. And oh, <laughs> oh, sorry, Lee. Oh, no, 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 Sherbet. Sherbet, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. I'm just placing stairs all over the place. Um, sorry, Lee. I accidentally nudged you, right, Sherbet? You can sit on the, the stairs for now. There we go. They're now friends again. Yep, <laughs> had to wait to make sure. Right, Lee Bear, make sure you don't run in front of me. I accidentally placed those stairs upside down, uh, so they're going to be no use to anyone. I don't know, unless you're an insect and you can walk upside down. And I guess I need to place some dirt down along here. Uh, just so we can go and make the, the stairs leading up like this. And then, why did you get rid of those one, Lee? <laughs> I need to go and place these back down here. And then place these stairs here. This is going to take no time at all. And uh, then I just need to do a, a little path leading straight to, to Harriet's front door. So then that way uh, she's going to have a, a nice easy route uh, to, to be able to, to get up to her house. So if I go and do these here. And uh, we just need to break away uh, a few more of these dirt blocks and vines. And oh, I can see a, a little bit of her hat shop there. I can see <laughs> a little bit of her hat shop through the uh, the hole there. Hopefully, uh, we're not going to actually dig into the shop itself. I think uh, we should just about uh, be able to avoid it. And oh, hello, Sherbert. <laughs> you suddenly got very excited. What is it? 
What is it? What have, what have you found? Are you, are you just happy? Are you just dancing? You just showing off your new dance move. It's very impressive. <laughs> he came up to me like, look at me, look at me, look at me dance. Stampy, Stampy, are you watching? Look at me dance. <laughs> it was very nice. Right, let's go and uh, place these down here and here and here. And then Sherbet, if you step out the way for just one second, I need to place a stair exactly where you're standing here. You can go down there for now, and I'm going to place this here, here, and here, and there we go. We've got a path leading the entire way up, and uh, so now we're just going to do it leading to uh, her house, I guess. And we might as well keep doing it, Oak. I won't switch to uh, to doing Birch. We'll just make it uh, one nice path that can lead around like this and uh, to the, the front of the house. I think I'm going to have dirt just around this little outer edge. Uh, otherwise, I think it will look a little bit weird uh, when you're looking at uh, looking up at it down from the bottom. Uh, but I'm going to get rid of these dirt blocks and I'm going to make these oak wood. And uh, I guess if I go around like this and Sherbert, are you intentionally trying to job in front of every block I try and place? <laughs> every time I try and turn around to place down a block, there's just a dog there just looking at me. <laughs> right, let's just go and build this along here. And uh, I guess I'm going to build this back a little bit uh, here as well. And um, <clears throat> I think this is going to look good. And then this is going to look good. And then if we build anything else uh, behind uh, this area, we can do this path leading off in that direction, uh, so it all leads round together. And I kind of like this little this little windy path like this. I think this looks quite cool. There we go. Uh, here is the path to Harriet's house. I'm just going to go and uh, change these little dirt bits. I'm going to make these oak as well, uh, so the path's not too thin uh, going around like that. There we go. So this is the, uh, the path that Harriet can use to get inside her front door. Uh, but what we also need to do as I do a path uh, leading to uh, her shop here. Well, we don't really need a path, actually. I think this is okay like this. We should probably block this off because this is a hit the target's old castle. And uh, yeah, we do not want anyone going down there. That is a uh, a cornered off zone now. Uh, but yeah, this is the, the little doorway uh, which leads to the, the hat shop. And there, there's something nice about it being really hidden, but I think I'm going to want it. I want it a little bit more obvious. Maybe just make it a, li a little bit nicer uh, just so you're not walking through like a dirt hallway uh, when you enter so uh, let me go and get these birch planks and uh, let me go and uh, surround this entire doorway with them like this and uh, then I guess I can add in a little sign that just says Harriet's hats and whoa this little this little dirt blocks dancing <laughs> I think it's copied Sherbet's dance moves look at that little dirt block go <laughs> there we go that's ah, a little bit of dirt dancing some dirty dancing <laughs> oh, dear, that, that is good that's some nice moves there from the dirt anyway let's not stand here watching a, a block of dirt dancing all day uh, let's go and uh, break away this a little bit and uh, let's go and uh, add in a, a sign then shall we uh, so I got my crafting table here I can just go and make myself uh, I only need one sign but you've got to make them in groups of three anyway so I guess I'm gonna have some some spare signs and uh, let's just put one down that just says Harriet's hat so that way uh, I don't think she's gonna get much passing trade from people walking around here uh, but if anyone is walking past and does see the sign uh, yeah and they need a new hat <laughs> anyone's walking past here of a cold head uh, might see the sign and go inside so let's go and uh, put this down here and uh, let's see if there's any chance of me spelling Harriet correctly. I think it's just like uh, H-A-R-R-I-O. Uh, and I think you can even use one or two T's. I'm going to use two. Uh, so Harriet's uh, hat then, shall we? So uh, Harriet's... And then will hats fit on the same line? I think it might just about. Let's see if it's going to work. There we go. Harriet's hats. There we go. And uh, do you like it, Sherbert? I think he does. Let's do, just try and pick up this dirt then, shall we? There we go. <laughs> right. So everything is in place. Everything is absolutely perfect. The only thing we're missing is Harriet herself. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and head over to where the shops are and try and find where Harriet actually is. So last time we saw her, uh, she was on top of the, the florist and uh, she was dancing as well. Everyone loves to dance around here, don't they? <laughs> and uh, yeah, she kind of got a little bit stuck in a hole, but I think I let her out. Uh, so let's see if she has gone and wandered around. Oh no, she's still stuck in that little hole. Oh, poor Harriet. She's been up here for over a week now. Poor Harriet. Well, luckily she is about to move to her brand new house and she still doesn't know yet uh, but I'm about to break the news to her Harriet Harriet hello 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 Harriet how you doing oh so you can get out the hole you just decided to stay in there I have some exciting news for you we have a very special surprise Harriet for you and we are going to take you straight to it but first we need to build a big minecart track so we can get you straight over there so if you just wait here uh, I'm sure you can wait here a little bit longer seeing how long uh, you've been here already uh, we are going to go and build a big minecart track leading all the way to where her house is and uh, luckily, 
I had a, a whole load of uh, spare minecart tracks uh, ready from when we got Harrison over to, to his house and uh, that worked. We were able to do it successfully and oh, oh Harriet, now you decide to leave. There we go. You go and wait back down here for now. We do not want you wandering off. I might actually uh, go and just block it off a little bit here because I do not want her to wander off yet because otherwise it's going to be really tough to get her in the, the minecart track. So let's go and uh, let's block this off here as well and I think, oh no, oh no, she can get up. No, just, just wait here. Just wait here for one second, Harriet. For one second. I know you're excited. I know you're excited to see, but please wait here for a little bit and we'll take you straight to it. Right, let's get this built quickly then. So I want to go and build all of these uh, minecart tracks leading over here and uh, we're going to go and skip across Googly Island and this is going to be dangerous because, uh, yeah, there's a, a reason this place is called Googly Island and uh, we can go down here and then we can go all the way uh, down that little stretch down here. And uh, yeah, hopefully uh, we can go down here. Is there going to be a nice natural ramp? Uh, kind of almost. We can kind of turn here. As you know, you can't really turn when it drops like that. But I can. I just go and place down a few more blocks. And uh, if I go and uh, do this one here, we don't want any sudden jumps. We want a nice smooth ride for Harriet as she comes down here. Uh, oh, no, I need to do one more block here. And then this bit's going to be really easy. It's just going to be one straight row uh, all the way uh, down to um, where we need to be down here. And oh, it looks like Lee Bear uh, is doing the track on the other side as well. So what we can do uh, is kind of just meet up in the middle and then that way she's going to be able to go straight there. And I do realize uh, that I'm not adding in any power rails yet. I'm just going to do all of the, the track first and then I'm going to go through afterwards and add in uh, all of the, the extra power rails uh, just to make sure she has uh, enough power to get there. And I think we should have a little test to go first. I think uh, we should send uh, either me, Lee or Sherbet in first just to, just to make sure everything's in order and it's all perfectly safe. <laughs> right, so here we go. We're about to link up. Yay! There we go. So does this lead all the way up to, to, to Harriet's house then, does it? Brilliant, that's going to take us straight inside. So all I need to do now uh, is go back through it all and add in all of my power rails then, I guess. So uh, let me go and grab my power rails here. And uh, actually, no, these are my redstone torches. I need them too. Uh, I need to place them next to the power rails uh, to give the power rails their power. So uh, instead of doing them really spread out, I might do them in like little groups of three. Uh, so then she'll get a, a big sudden burst of speed. But to be honest, uh, this bit won't be too hard because uh, she would have just come down this ramp here. Uh, she should. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh no. I got hit again. I got hit again. No, Sherbet. Lee is our friend. Remember, repeat after me. Lee is our friend. Okay. Lee is our our friend. Is, is, is he listening? Is he listening? There we go. He listened to me. <laughs> oh, dear. Ooh, this is quite an exciting bit. This this drop should be okay, actually. This drop should be okay. We shouldn't need too many power rails there, Lee. Uh, just because we would have done that big drop, uh, we should actually be uh, all right. And where... Where is Harriet? <gasps> is Harriet? I think Harriet's gone in here and she's being chased by zombies. Oh no, we need to save her. We need to save her. There's zombies all over the place. She has. She fled. She fled into the police station because of all of the, the zombies. Right, Harriet. You stay there. We'll build the mine track to you. <gasps> that was dangerous. The zombies went after her, Lee Bear. And oh, there's a creeper over there. There's a creeper over there. Right. I'll build this mine cart. Lee Bear, you be on googly patrol, okay? And it uh, looks like we're going to have to do a, a little bit of a, a diversion here and uh, make the, the mine cart, uh, the mine cart tracks go down this way instead. I knew it was a mistake to build near Googly Island. Uh, so we can go, oh no, 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 no. Where's the creeper? I hear hissing. I hear hissing. Oh, it's right there. It's right there. No. <laughs> Uh-oh! Uh-oh! I gave you one job, Lee Bear, to watch out for the googlies, and look what happened. <laughs> only joking, only joking. And oh, the pigs! The pigs are escaping from the police station! <laughs> oh, don't worry, let's block this off then, shall we, before Harriet wanders out into the, the dangerous night. Right, the pigs got out. The pig was just waiting for his chance. I think those pigs were working with the creepers together, uh, and I think that was a, a big police station breakout there. <laughs> right, let's go and uh, link these up down here then. And uh, we do it straight to the, the front of where the, the police station is. So this needs to go down like this. And this is going to loop around here. And uh, we can eventually make them going actually inside of the police station. Uh, just to make sure we do get Harriet on it. Uh, but now uh, I need to go and add uh, a whole load more power rail. So if I do uh, a bunch at the bottom of the ramp, uh, that should be enough. Uh, to power it all the way up the ramp. So I'm going to go and do two down here and uh, light this up. And uh, I'm going to go and do some here as well and uh, have these lit up uh, just to give her a nice
nice big speed boost if I go and put a torch down there. And uh, do you think this is going to be enough? Uh, maybe if I do uh, a few more up here just to give a, another extra boost of power. If I go and place two down here. And then that should be enough to power it to the edge. And then we're going to go down so that might be fast enough. And hello Hilda! Hello Henry! Are you guys okay? <laughs> Hilda looks worried. Look, she's pacing up and down in her room. Something must be troubling her. Oh, I wonder what that is. <laughs> I wonder what would trouble a big iron golem. Uh, anyway, let's go and uh, have something to eat then because I'm getting a little bit hungry. I guess this apple will do for now. And oh, oh, I heard a skeleton shooting at me. There's skeletons all over the place. Ow, I'm getting hurt. Where is it? Oh, it's dropped down here. It's chasing after me. All right, let's try and take out this skeleton, shall we? Uh, if it's going to shoot bows at me, I am going to go and shoot bows at it as well. Oh, no, it's taken out now anyway. Right, what I'm going to do... Before sending uh, Harriet over, I am going to go and have myself a, a little bit of a, a test to go uh, just to see whether this is uh, working or not. So uh, if I go and make myself uh, another crafting table, uh, I'm going to be able to make myself uh, a minecart. And you want to give me a, a little bit of a, a boost, Lee Bed. You want to give me a little bit of a push and uh, we can test it to see uh, whether it's going to be good enough. So let me go and make myself a little minecart and I'll place it down here and jump in. Right, if you go give me a little bit of a nudge, uh, let's see if I'm going to make it all the way to the house. Oh, that was good. I got up the hill. This is like a roller coaster. It's like a roller coaster leading me the whole way there, and I'm going really fast, and I'm making it all the way up here, and there we go! straight into the house. What I might do is actually make it go even further into the house just in case she gets out and wanders somewhere else. Let's break away this door for now and uh, let's add in a, a few more tracks uh, to lead her all the way to the, the back and uh, then that way we can go and place the doors in and that way she's not going to wander off anyway. But that worked absolutely perfectly and why was I going to walk back? Why walk when you can ride? Here we go. Let's see if it works in the other direction. Here we go. I've got in. Whoa, I'm going so fast. <laughs> I'm going even faster in this direction. Can I make it up the hill? Oh, hello, Sherbet. I can't remember telling you to sit down there. And whoop, straight back to the police station. That worked absolutely beautifully. So it worked for me. Hopefully, it's going to, to work for Harriet, right? I need you on Googly Patrol. I need you on Googly Patrol, uh, Lee. Make sure nothing comes to attack us. Right. The big challenge now, then, is to try and get Harriet into this minecart. So uh, this is going to be, um, yeah, easier said than done. So let's just go and put down uh, a whole load of tracks. And I think if I just do them past her and then set one off, uh, she's just going to go and get pushed into it, I think. So if I go and do it like this, actually, if I just do one and just push it, there we go. There we go. She's in it. She's in it. She is off. She is off. She is whizzing round. Right, let me go and make another one. And I'm going to go and follow after her and uh, try and get there as quick as I can. Right, let me go and place this down and give it a nudge and I'm gonna go and get myself set off. Right, here I go! <laughs> Can I tell Sherbet to stand up on my way? Do you think that's possible? Oh no, I nearly did, I nearly did. Oh Lee, get off the track, get off the track, Lee, Lee, get off the track! Whoop! <laughs> Just got past Lee there and here we go! And Harriet is inside the house. That worked remarkably well. So let me go and put the, the door back down then, shall we? And then that way she won't be uh, wandering off anywhere else. Let me just go and place this down here and uh, this down here as well. You can get inside if you want her, Lee Bear. <laughs> and anyway, Harriet, surprise! This is your lovely new home. This is Harriet Hill. Let me just go and get rid of these minecart tracks on the floor. We do not want these messing up your brand new floor. And if I try and break away this minecart very carefully, there we go! You can now wander about your brand new home. But not only have we built you a new house, Hill, um, Harriet, we have also built you a brand new shop for hats. We know how much you love hats. So if I pull this lever down here, you'll see behind you uh, there is a, a secret hat shop. You can look down there. You can go down and have a look if you want, Harriet. You can go and climb down the ladder. And uh, yeah, this is your very own hat shop. So you can go behind that counter if you want and uh, all the customers can come through this little door here and uh, we got lots of different color hats. And oh, Harriet, Harriet, where did, where did you go? Oh, you're sneaking around here. You're sneaking around. Wait, you're playing hide and seek. Come back here, Harriet. <laughs> look at her sneaking around the place. Yeah, look, you got all of these different hats. You got a, um, you got the Spectacular Sky Sensation. Uh, you got the Baby Blue Bonanza. You got the Denim Delight. You got the uh, Pretty Pink one. You got the Boisterous Bruise. You got the Grass Stain Fantasy. Time for Lime. Hello, Yellow. Orange, you're glad you got a hat. And Embarrassed Panda. All of these uh, different color hats. Uh, you got all of these in here. And uh, yeah, so you can go and uh, put them on your head or you can sell them to people and basically have a jolly good time. Do you like it? Do you like it? Of course you do. <laughs> there we go. Another happy person inside of Stampy's lovely world. And that was probably the most fun I've had trying to get anything anywhere. That was absolutely awesome. So let's go and uh, shut up the uh, the secret hatch and uh, let Harriet get sorted uh, in the shop. But sadly for now, uh, we have just about run out of time in this video. Oh, Harriet! 
You did that very quickly. How did you... What the... How did you get there so fast? <laughs> that was unbelievable. Okay, well, yeah, you can go and have a, a look around, I guess. You don't have to stay inside of the, the shop. I suppose there is just this uh, other little doorway through here, but that was really, really fast. <laughs> that confused me for a second, but sadly, uh, we have just about run out of time in this episode here, but don't worry. I will be leaving a, a link in the description uh, to the next episode uh, in my lovely world, uh, and that will be online uh, very soon. Uh, so for now, I want to thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you all... And later. Bye!